Hey guys, so I just finished dinner or well, I guess lunch and dinner. I really didn't eat anything since this morning when I had pancakes. Um, I bought some tteokbokki on my way home uh, from my second round of shopping for everybody. And I thought since I shared with you me shopping, um, I thought I would share now what I got. Um, and I'm gonna go through uh, based on stores and then what I got at each store because I went to one, two, three, four, five, five or six different shops. Um, I think five, five different shops that I went to. Um, no, six, six different shops that I went to. So I thought I would share with you what I bought and where um, and who, who it's for uh, because why not? Um, so first, my older brother, uh, he likes to drink and we can't find this in our area. You can buy it in like Indianapolis um, or like Chicago and stuff, but you can't, our, our city is too small. Even though we have an Asian market, our city is too small for this. So I'm going to take him home some, you guessed it, soju, soju, soju. I'm taking him some chamiso home. This is the strongest one. I want him to die. Not really die. I'm just joking. I want him to see like how intense it is. But I bought him four bottles of just the little glass. They're actually glass. So this is going to have to like super insulated and stuff in my bags. Um, but I bought him four of these. Here. Four chamiso sojus. Um, so that's for my older brother. These are just kind of like small gifts. They're not anything crazy. Um, some of the other people I bought actual like presents for for Christmas, um, which by the time this is up, it will be Christmas already and they won't have seen it. So it's okay to share with you what I bought. Um, next in Lotte as well is ramen for my younger brother. Uh, so I bought soju for my older brother. I bought ramen for my younger brother. Uh, Shin Ramen, the black, this one here, is actually my favorite ramen. Um, so I'm taking this home for him. He liked it last time. He said it was a bit spicy, but it's not that spicy. So, you know, the cat is trying to get out right now. And then I just bought this one as well. I've heard good things. I don't eat a lot of ramen, so, and when I do, I, I get this. So I've never tried this before, but we'll see what my brother says. Um, he loves ramen. He's a huge ramen person. Um, so there's that. And I also bought him a pot noodle, um, but I thought I'd try something different. Instead of ramen, I got him a jajameyang pot noodle. Um, I've never had this, I don't know if it's any good, and I don't know if he'll like the flavor. My mom, when she was in Korea, absolutely adored jajameyang. I don't like it. Uh, it's, not my, it's not my style at all. If I go to uh, Chinese for dinner, which is very rare, I get jjampong, which is the spicy noodle soup type thing and not jajameyang, but my mom, like I said, absolutely adored it, loved it. So we'll see if my younger brother likes it, because this is for him as a little mini, here you go, brother. <laughs> um, and then for my father, oh no, that's it for Lotte. We're done with Lotte. Let's go on to Daiso. I got these for my father. He likes them. They're just like shower exfoliants. He likes them, he needed a few more. So I bought them for him. Uh, for my, one of my girlfriends, for her birthday, I bought her a bunch of kitchen stuff because she got me some kitchen stuff for my birthday last year, but she actually likes to cook. And so I thought these were really cute. Um, but this is like a little silicone brush right and again this is from daiso so little silicone brush he's hilarious um a bird peeler for an orange a silicone scraper that looks like a bird as well and this cute little uh cleaning pad it looks like a strawberry um so i got her some of this uh for her 
um, for a little care package type thing that I'm doing for her for her birthday. Um, it's going to go with a couple other things that I got her from different shops. Um, and her husband, I got him a little mug. It's hilarious. Dandy cat. <laughs> Meow. <laughs> Shall we have some tea together? <laughs> I think it's so funny. And Mitch, I think, will think it is hilarious as well. Um, so we'll see. That's that. Uh, and I got that at Daiso as well. Um, I got this little pencil case for my nephew because I think it's hilarious. And I thought it would be funny to just give him a like little banana. And he's going to be like, why? Because I'm weird, you know. Um, I got this for myself when I go home. My parents' dryer stopped working, so they don't have a dryer at their house. Well, I don't dry things anyway except for my towels because I've been in Korea so long. I didn't have a dryer, and now I do, but I'm so used to it that I don't dry. But um, I bought laundry hooks because they have, like, hmm towel racks and racks and stuff that you can hang your clothes on, but they don't have these. And these come in really handy with like socks and underwear. You can hang a lot of stuff with these. So I bought my mom, it's just a dollar. So I bought these for my parents. So when I'm there, I can use them. Um, I did that last year too. I bought them uh, little things that you can put in the washing machine. So like your undergarments aren't like ruined and stuff. Um, so this is for my parents' house and not necessarily for anybody. Um, I'm going to use them. And I'm assuming my parents will use them as well. Uh, I got two more things from Daiso. No, three more things. I got two little pouches. Like I said, I'm doing a little bit of a uh, care package type thing. One for my niece and the other for my girlfriend, Krista. Um, and I'm going to do little care packages. Um, and then where did I go? Oh, I got a shit ton of face masks. I got lemon, I got cucumber, and I got honey. Uh, these are super cheap here. They are more expensive in the U.S., so I bought 30 face masks. And they're for various people. Again, my niece, my mom, uh, Krista, um, some of my girlfriends. I just bought a bunch of sheet masks um, for them. And that is it for Daiso. Oh no, that's not it for Daiso. I bought this for my niece. This is my happy face. It's a mirror. <laughs> See, so uh, I thought it was cute and I'm gonna put it in that little care package. Like it's gonna go into here, right? Uh, for her because it's gonna be like a mini care package type thing. Uh, next is... Mm. Oh, a toot house. I just bought one little thing uh, for my niece. Again, care package. It's a tint. She's 12, so I didn't get a color tint. I got a little glitter tint. I thought that was appropriate um, for a kid. Like, she's still a kid, okay? Okay, she's still a kid. Her brother, my brother will kill me if, if like, I get her something that's, like, crazy. But, like, it looks like a little ice cream. But it's a little tint and it doesn't have color to it. I already tested it. Um, it's not a lot of color. It's just really cute. And the packaging is adorable. Like, look, it's an ice cream. So I thought I'd get her, I got her that at a Etude House and that was it. I didn't really see anything else that one was appropriate for a 12 year old and two that I actually liked. Um, so I bought her that at a Etude House. Then I went to Innisfree um, and I bought Krista, again, we're doing that care package thing. I bought Krista a volcanic clay mask um, because she's been asking me, um, which is why I did all of those videos for like my skincare routine. She's been asking me for advice for like ever. And so I thought I would put together some things that she can use um, at home and then help her with some of the other things that she can buy at home. Um, she can actually get this in the US. Uh, Innisfree has shops and they have online stuff as well. So she can reorder this when she's out of it. Um, but yeah, so I got her this because she was talking about like blackheads and stuff. And this will help with blackhead control as well as like skin purification. So got her this. 
Um, and that is it for Innisfree. That's the only thing I got there. Um, and then I went over to Skin Food and I got a few things there. Um, again, Krista, I got her a uh, peeling foot facial thingy, not facial, foot mask. Um, it peels your socks. It's the little socky ones, you know? So I got her this because it's just fun. It's, it's a fun uh, thing to do, and I thought I'd put it in the care package with all of the other stuff. She didn't particularly ask for this, but I just think it's fun and kind of quirky and kind of Korea, because um, I don't think I've ever seen these in the U.S. Um, I haven't been back since February, so I don't know, but and I'm not looking for them, but I got her this. Um, and I also got her the black sugar uh, black sugar mask wash off. It's basically an exfoliant. Uh, you scrub your face and you, yeah, you rinse it off and stuff. You leave it and then you rinse it off and it takes off all the dead skin. I actually used to use this, um, before I rebought my new, my newest Clarisonic because my Clarisonic quit working, my first one. And so then I was like, oh, well, you know, Clarisonic's kind of expensive. Do I want another one? Blah, 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 blah. So to exfoliate, I started using this. And I actually love it. It's one of my favorites. Um, and it's a bestseller at Skin Food. So, uh, yeah, the Black Sugar Mask Wash Off. It's great. I got her that. Again, she's been talking about things. So I got her a few things. And for my niece, I got her a hand cream that's shaped like a bear. Isn't this the cutest? The flavor is kiwi. Uh, it's a gummy bear shape. It's kind of squishy. It's adorable. It's appropriate for a 12 year old because come on, let's be honest. She's 12. She's still a kid, right? 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 Am I being overprotective? Probably. <laughs> um, so that's it for skin food. And then I got two things. Well, one, two things for some of my best friends. Um, these are just Korea gifts. They're not actually their Christmas presents. I'm going to buy them when I'm in the U.S. But I got these at the Sam and they're hand creams, but they're hilarious. Both of these girls, Carolyn and Amy, lived in Korea um, for a good amount of time and that's where we met. Um, and I'm going to see them for my birthday in Vegas. So I'm really excited. But I got them some stuff, kind of a cheeky little this is Korea and it's hilarious and it's gonna remind them of being here and being with me because they left me, because they're turd heads. <laughs> um, so, but yeah, I got these for them. First of all, they look like choco pies, right? Like you look at them from the side, they look like choco pies. They're not choco pies, they're not. They're hand cream. It is the funniest hand cream I have ever seen. They're so funny. Um, so I got these for them as like a little joke about Korea and stuff um, because they're hilarious. Like, come on, a choco pie hand cream. It literally looks like a choco pie. It's in choco pie packaging. It's just gonna be funny. I'm gonna give them to them as like a, hey, this is like a little Korea thing. Here you go, ladies, just as a laugh. It's not their present or anything. Um, so yes, I just think these are the funniest thing ever. Um, and I saw them the other day when I was looking, um, I just had to buy them. Um, they're adorable, but that is everything. I got a lot at Daiso, um, and a lot at Lotte and just miscellaneous things. Um, like I said, I'm going to make little care packages with stuff inside for Christmas and birthday presents. One of them's a birthday, the other's a Christmas present um, for my niece and one of my closest friends slash sister. Um, and then just random gifts for everybody else. They're just like small little tokens, not like anything super crazy or serious. I might buy my mother some hand cream. I'm not sure yet. Um, we'll see what happens, but this video is really long. Um, I will see you guys next time. I love you. Uh, and I'll see you in my next video, which will be about America probably, because by this time of when this is up, I'm gonna be in America. Bye guys.